Hello and welcome to this week's edition of Can I Use with your host, Don Picker. Hello, 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 and thank you for joining us. As ever, the grand prize is... A 2014-era MacBook Pro with a functional keyboard and no f***ing touch bar. And the rules are simple. Our contestant has to guess which web browsers support a given web platform feature, and therefore whether an author, a web developer, can safely use that feature. This week, the subject is ERS modules. Using the type equals module syntax, one can enable the importing of JavaScript modules. Doing away with scoping hacks like immediately invoked function expressions and ultimately retiring slow and difficult to configure bundling tools. And on the line, we have our contestant, Bryn. Bryn, I understand you're Australian. Nah, mate, I'd just like to affect an offensively inaccurate Australian accent. I see, but it says here you were born in the bush. I was born in a bush, mate. Right, and for argument's sake, where was this bush? London. Shepherd's bush. Well, that's just needlessly confusing. Okay, are you ready? Yeah, defo. Stop the clock. First up, it's... Internet Explorer a lover. What do you think, Bryn? Support or no support for ES modules? Mate, I supports f*** all. I hardly think it's going to support a contemporary JavaScript modularity mechanism natively. Well, that's not entirely fair. IE11 does support some ES6 features, such as const, let, and the map data structure. Well, la di da I'm going to say no support. No support. Okay, let's see. And you are... Correct! Oh, you little ripper! IE11 does not support ES modules natively. However, there's no reason not to use native ES modules in production. Browsers that support type equals module support all of the ES6 features, meaning transpilation to ES5 is not necessary. Meanwhile, these browsers ignore scripts marked with no module, which is a boolean. Older browsers don't understand no module, so they do load these scripts, which can contain ES5 JavaScript. And that's everyone covered. Is that clear, Bryn? Eh. Moving on. Next is Microsoft Edge. It's a Microsoft browser, Bryn, but is it up to snuff? Well, I mean, it's not IE. It's better than IE. At least I think it is. I only f***ing testing crime. Care to hazard a guess, then? No support. No support for Edge. Let's see if you're right. You are not right. Oh, rack off, bouncer. Sorry, but it's true. With one caveat. No module scripts are not executed, but they are fetched. Currently, this means Edge users would download each piece of JavaScript functionality twice. Given that Edge is moving to be built on Chromium, bringing full ES module support along with it, a more efficient way to handle the i11 and legacy Edge browsers might be to serve them no JavaScript at all, by exclusively using type equals module. Server-side rendering and progressive enhancement for the win. Well, I think it's fair to say we're out of the woods, but now comes Firefox. It's a great little browser with some fantastic dev tools, but it did take approximately 7 million years to support the version 1 syntax of web components. How do you think it's done with ES modules? Well, Dong, I happen to know, right, that Firefox supports all new ES6 features except something called tail call optimization, and I don't even know what the f*** that is, so I'm going support. Support? Support. Correct, with a market share of about 10%. Firefox does indeed support ES modules. Coming up the quickfire rounds, but first a word from our sponsors. D1.js, the one dimensional drawing and animation library. With D1.js, you can create this, this, and even this. Wow. D1.js, you have to draw the line somewhere. We're back with Bryn. Bryn, are you ready for the quickfire round? Yeah, I suppose. F*** me up. Chrome. Supports. Correct. Including Chrome for Android. Safari. Eh, supports. Right again. Including for iOS. Opera. Supports. Correct once again. Android browser. Supports. And finally. Sub sub internet. Supports. Stop the clock. That's right. 
I'd say that's pretty darn good support overall. So did I win? Win what? The quiz, you daft No, Bryn, because... There are no winners in the browser wars. Oh, you f***ing wet it. Browser. Clap. One purchase. Clap. Hypertext. Clap. The word.